Some say it's a first of its kind here in Tennessee. News Channel 5's Olivia Michael shows us why one new Nashville restaurant is creating some buzz. This will be the kitchen of Germantown's newest restaurant, but unlike the rest, it'll be offering up unique sides to accompany your dishes. So this will be right when you walk in. This will be where, you, where you'll, you'll get greeted and you'll get greeted over there. There'll be a gift shop over there and then the bar is over here. Here you'll find traditional bar foods on the menu. And you're going to have regular ketchup and mustard and barbecue sauce and ranch dressing uh, on your table. But the secret is in the sauce. But if you wanted the THC infused, the CBD infused, all derived from hemp, um, you can get those ramekins and they are sealed, pre-manufactured and come here straight to the facility. You heard that right. You can order chicken fingers with a side of THC. So Buds and Brews came uh, to formulation because we know people love to, you know, sit at a sports bar, watch a game, have a beer, and we wanted to have a cannabis themed concept to go along with that. Owner Michael Solomon says it's all about portion control. Although the entrees won't contain THC, customers can opt for hemp derived sauces with dosing spoons that meet the state's legal limits. So the bar is going to come off right here. THC infused mocktails and desserts are on the menu too. We'll have your smoky margarita. Uh, we will have your bloody Mary Jane. <laughs> And we'll have your, you gotta have your Nashville favorite. We will have not the bushwhacker, we will have the weed whacker. In this budding industry, Solomon feels now is the time and Nashville is the place for buds and brews. It's gonna take an accepting community to be like, hey, we'll accept the first, you know, cannabis restaurant in the state of Tennessee. And I think the people of Germantown have that perspective. The restaurant is set to open in a few weeks. In Nashville, Olivia Michael, News Channel 5.